So it's a beautiful sunny day here in December and I'm gonna go on a photography adventure. You know why? So I just got a new camera lens and I need to test it out. And you know what I got? I got 60 degrees sunshine in the Blue Ridge Mountains. So let's go. Jesus, Jesus, hope and joy in a baby boy come to love. So, just look at this view, guys. There we go. Look at that. Now it takes a picture. A few moments later. So I just took some pretty cool pictures out there with a 24 millimeter lens that I just got. It's really nice. It's really small, which is cool for like taking pictures that's so compact. But I just had a little scare. I took some really cool pictures, but I walked back, was pulling my phone out of my pocket, dropped my phone face down on the asphalt. But it didn't break. So lucky day. I will also want to apologize for lying earlier. I said it was 60 degrees out, but actually it's only 50 degrees out. But it's still pretty warm, it's really nice out. For me, being from Minnesota, anything over freezing is a warm winter day. So I'll take 50 degrees. So, almost got stuck, but that's why we have four wheel drive. So, I don't know, my next place to take some pictures. So I'm out here, and look what I get to look at. Enjoy the beautiful day. It's 45 degrees right now. It's cooled off a little bit. I'm up on Mount Pisgah. It's over there. There's a nice little inn resort. So I'm just out here enjoying the beautiful, beautiful day, sunny day. I was going to try to take some time lapses, but it's not really that much clouds or anything moving around. So it's going to be a little hard to get a good time lapse of all the clouds moving or stuff like that. So just going to try to maybe just take some pictures, maybe do a time lapse or two. But just, yeah, just having a beautiful day out here. So today is December 23rd, so it's Christmas Eve, Christmas Adam, day before Christmas Eve. Last day of kind of sanity before the Christmas season rolls in. It's odd because this is the first year I'm not going to be home for Christmas. So it's been 23 years, this is my first time I'm not going to be home for Christmas. Every other year I've been home. During high school I was always home or with family. We were always, either we went traveling somewhere or stayed at home and did something. In college I'd always managed to make it home for Christmas. Last year was the time I made it home the latest, but I made it home about four or five days before Christmas. So, being it this year, my first year as an adult and kind of off on my own, I'm not going to be home for Christmas. And there's a couple reasons for that. The main one is Christmas is on a Sunday, and as a minister, you kind of have to work. So, I'm going to be there working on Sunday, Christmas Sunday. Second thing is, I went home for Thanksgiving, and I was kind of like my being home for the holidays and that Christmas, they didn't want to, parents didn't want to fly me home twice because it's super expensive. Airline tickets are around Christmas time, and it's just crazy because I went Thanksgiving. I flew into Thanksgiving early and out of Thanksgiving early. Like I flew in Monday night and then left Saturday, but it was still crazy. I'd never seen an airport that busy before on my time of traveling, which was nothing because those were even the busier days. So I knew that going home for Christmas would just be even crazier. So I'm home for Christmas. I'm my home, not home home, which is strange, but it's going to be good. I'm enjoying, looking forward to it. Going to get to work on Sunday morning, then hang out in the afternoon and just, you know, relax lay around, not do much, so we can probably FaceTime my family while I open presents, but it's gonna be enjoyable just kinda, of, you know, relax and sit around and not be too busy on Christmas. So that's what today is. Today is kinda of me going out and doing something because I know that tomorrow I'm probably not gonna feel inclined to go out and do anything. And then Christmas Day I'm not gonna feel inclined to go out and do anything either. And then probably after Christmas Day, Boxing Day, I probably won't feel inclined to go out and do anything anyways. So I'm just gonna take out take today as my go out and explore and enjoy some stuff. And then take Christmas as it is, as you know, a day to rest and enjoy and celebrate the season. So that's my thoughts on Christmas for 2016. So I just finished taking a bunch of pictures. I used my 24 millimeter lens, my 50 millimeter lens, and then my 18 to 55 with a wide angle attachment on it. So I'm gonna send those through in a big jumbo slideshow quick clip thing.
and I'll also put up the time lapse that I took. So I'm not sure what I'm gonna do now. It's about 2.45 in the afternoon. I think I'm gonna maybe go find another spot, maybe take some more pictures, or head on back and start editing this vlog so I can get it up. But I don't know, the afternoon's wide open for me, so we'll see what happens. So I stopped, took some more pictures. This is where I'm at. There you go. Find a nice little spot up by a tunnel. But it's really pretty out. Got some really good wide angle shots of that new 24 millimeter lens. I mean, it is, it really opens up and you can see everything, which is amazing. So, so far so good. We'll see where else we go and end up now. So stop another overlook. This one is nice because you can see both sides the mountains right on top of ridge actually i was here a couple weeks ago and i saw a bear down in the woods so but this is one of my favorite spots to come take pictures because they're just they almost essentially a 360 degree view which is pretty great for taking pictures so got some good ones out didn't have to leave my car which is pretty cool too to be able to sit here in my car and do it you know which sounds lazy but it's like i really don't want to walk out, get out you know try to walk around but hey get some good pictures today so that's all that matters So I made it back for my photo adventure. It was a lot of fun, fun couple of hours. Now, you know, the main reason I came back is because I was running out of gas. So I was like, well, probably should get back before I get I was running out of gas and leave this park. So I'm back now. I'm gonna load the pictures and videos tonight, edit it, make a vlog, we'll see how that comes out. But until then, Merry Christmas, y'all.